Management Options, Central Management. By the end of this training, you'll be able to configure Quantum Spark as a centrally managed device. In a previous video, we've discussed the three options to manage your Quantum Spark. It can either be locally managed, which means you'll use the local web application to manage your device. You can either use the central managed option, which we'll use right now, which means you'll use a dedicated management server to manage your appliance or through Spark management. In this specific video, we'll walk you through using centrally managed device. If you're using the central managed device, it means the web UI is only going to be useful for OS configuration, managing IP addresses and stuff like that. But the security policy aspect, that will be configured through Smart Console. Why would you use this? Because it's scalable. You have multiple gateways, multiple locations. You want to manage it from a single place. That's why you use centrally managed device. So what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to set up a management server, which will manage this box right here. Since my device is after first time wizard and I don't want to go ahead and reset it, I'll need to adjust it from the web UI. So I'm going to home security management, select central and hit apply. And the first thing you can see is how everything here changed. You no longer see everything related to the security policy because you will now do that from Smart Console. So just like any security gateway, you now need to go ahead and set up a SIG password. So I'm going to set up. Now I don't have security management service, but this is something you can definitely do. In my case, I have a classic open server security management server. Press next. Um, I'll connect to the management server later. Press finish. Now I have SIC ready. Now I'll need to go to Smart Console. Set up a new gateway. Classic. Give it a name. the IP address under hardware I'm going to select my appliance communication set up the password Okay, trust established, press OK. I have the proper topology, press OK. Let me go ahead and install the policy. And that's it, succeeded. So I now have a security management server managing a classic open server security gateway and a 1590 appliance, which is my very own QuantumSpark device. Thank you for watching.